Would you eat food from a farm with no soil? You probably already have. Vertical farms are a way of growing food indoors rather than in fields. They can widen the range of things grown, particularly in a changing climate, reduce use of water and fertilizers, and could make food more nutritious too. But are they a sustainable route to mass food production? The plants in a vertical farm are suspended in hydroponic or aeroponic units, which can be expensive. They're supplied with all they need to grow and any excess water and nutrients can be recycled and reused. However, controlling temperature and light in the farms requires lots of energy. Whilst the plants benefit from environmental protection, they cannot get sun and rain for free like plants in a field. Right now, vertical farms are being run in supermarkets, disused city buildings, old bomb shelters, providing fresh food to restaurants and supermarkets on their doorstep. It's not currently possible to grow all plants in these conditions commercially, and at the moment it's mostly limited to high value or specialist crops. Vertical farms seem here to stay and have important challenges to be resolved. Do the savings in water and land use outweigh the extra energy costs in running the system? Can the farm be run entirely on renewable energy? Can the technology be adapted to supply a greater range of foods in a sustainable way? Can the technology be used to produce biopharmaceuticals or other industrial products? Are vertical farms going to change the future of food?